Hi, I'm not gonna say it. in this video I'm gonna show you some bugs that you may you didn't know about so not like my old videos that I try to explain things easy simple and fast this time I try to show you this problem and I hope I can show you in the best way so let's begin the problem that I want to talk about is about animation end and you may know about it but in most cases I think you didn't try to resolve it or you may resolve it but in here you can see that we have some animation that we want to loop again and again and again and um, in some animation you don't want to loop and you want to play it once okay in game maker how you can do that you just check what is the image index and if it reach the frames that your animation has and in that time you set image speed equals zero and it will stop there but there is a problem let me show you stop this game in a sprite in here you can see that for waking up so this this enemy can wake up and can go to sleep okay so it should be able to play once okay not loop through okay so it should go at the end wait and whenever we want it go at the frame zero like you can see it in here we don't want it to loop and you can see if we if we are here at the image index zero and we set the image speed to one because we have six frame and we set the fps to 12 because the image speed is one it will go through these frames and we want to stay in there in frame number six okay so the animation is completed after this animation played maybe we want this character to go to sleep okay so it should the image speed should be minus one and it will go back and it will go to sleep and it should stay here okay so there are some way to do this good way and bad way and semi good way <laughs> so in here we have this object enemy okay we have states we have gravity we have enemy logic we have enemy movement and if there is a show debug messages that show our image index what is the image index let me go to this sprite again the image index if the or if we play animation and it is in here it play through here to frame number one the image index is one if you play two frame the image index is number two so the image index is the number a frame that you played but the problem is that your animation is six frame and your fps that you set in your sprite is 12 and your room speed is say 60 or 30 okay so this image index it's not a integer number it's float number so it can go here go here go here so so if you go to this object enemy in here and you say in the you see in the enemy die state function we check if image index is greater and or equal to image number minus one so what it does let me show you let's first just close everything and just open this wake up and or object okay so we use this sprite animation here to wake up and sleep okay and in here in this state machine the state of sleep and wake up we check in here we check if the image index image index you know what it is is this the, the frame that we are on okay is greater or equal to image number the image number is six so there is six frame one two three four five six so there is six frame but the image index is a start from zero so that's why we minus it by we decrease it by one unit okay so it should work right in this case it will work but in in some cases it won't work and that's where you don't get what is the problem and you may don't find it as well so in this case it will work and let me show you for the sleep and wake up you can see the enemy is let me go here so you can see it clearly it's wake up if you go further from him it will go to sleep but look at the image index okay if we go left it wake up the image intake index is 5.0.7 so is that a problem yes it is a problem let me show you what is the problem um if we go to this let me decrease the size of this window so we are at the frame image index of 5.057 okay and where it is it's at 5.7 it's like this and if you say the Frame number one, it takes five milliseconds to end, and frame number two, five milliseconds, and each frame should stay up and it should be five milliseconds to end. Okay, so in this case, it gets less than that. Okay, it won't get five milliseconds. Why? Because in, in image index number 5.07, 
we stop the animation like this we say if the image index is equal or more than five in this case because image number minus one is five if it's greater or equal to image uh, to five just uh, stop the animation with images the image speed equal zero so in this case because our character go to sleep and stay there and go to uh, wake up a state and it stay there you don't see the difference and there is no problem in this case but in our player let me show you the problem in our player in our player in this attack state okay in here again we check if image index we did just like that okay and you may think that there is no problem in here but there is a problem if you go to a sprite of this to the stand you can see that this frame should stay for five milliseconds for example maybe it's uh, it should wait a lot more so this frame for example take five milliseconds to complete this frame should take five milliseconds and this frame as well but this frame it may take it, it won't take that much that five milliseconds this frame won't stay as as long as this frame before it take okay so the problem is that we check if it's more than three and if it's here and you know that image index is a float value and if it's here it's like a staying just one millisecond for this cycle okay so let's just again go to object player and in here let's just play it and shoot you may you may don't see the problem in here okay but there is a problem one of the frames for shooting animation is not playing as long as other frames of this animation so for fixing that i create this script that check if the animation is ended and it returns uh, true or false for you okay so if the animation ended in that case go to next state or play another animation or play this animation again okay so in that case when the animation is ended but there is a there is sometimes that you want for example this this wake up and sleep animation in here that you don't need to complete this animation this way you want to complete it in reverse so image speed is minus one it should go to frame number zero so this image animation so this is animation ended won't work for us and the animation interval should work for us okay let me play it again what this animation interval is uh let's say we shoot this and you can see the um image index in this case is 5.2 and let let's just go up close this so we can find it yeah you can see our image index stop at number 7.2 and you can see the, the difference value between last image index and this image index in here you can see the difference this is the animation interval and you can have that with div dividing the sprite index fps by room speed so what is this sprite index let me show you in here so you can see that we have 18 here so this fps frame per second if we if you divide this fps that is 8 in this case by room speed it will give you this interval that we have that's how easy it get okay so we can use that of course in most cases you don't need this but in some cases you see the difference so instead of this just saying image number minus one we can minus it by animation interval okay so what will happen here first let's just show the image index in here with this show divide messages image index and for this enemy in here let's just comment this out and let's just cut this for now to show you what is the difference so let's just cut this this show divide messages to here to our state because i don't want to show the state other states image index okay so let's just run it to see what will happen if we shoot you can see that our image index start from zero almost zero to number three okay why because we use image number minus one so it is three there is four frame in this image animation in a sprite animation and if you minus it by one it will give you three because imagine this start from zero so it will just go to three and i think your animation won't be completed like this and i did explain it what is the problem no let's just add that animation interval by minus it animation interval and no we can remove this minus one because this minus one wasn't perfect for us now let's just play it and shoot and you can see that it will go through 3.93 okay so it's almost play all of your animation by right amount of milliseconds this video take too long 
to explain. I did record it two times to make it perfect so you can understand what is the problem. Most of you know what was the problem. But I wanted to show you those who doesn't know. So please hit that like button. It helps me a lot. It motivates me a lot. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.